Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show the steps on getting the cursed dual katana. But before we go into the video. Make sure to subscribe and like as these videos take a long time to make. I hope you enjoy. We have the requirements for CDK. You need 400 mastery on both Yammer and Tushita sword. Start off at the entrance of the mansion at Turtle Island. Then follow this right path until you see a building. There should be an NPC near the wall. Talk to the NPC and press OK. Go to the other side and the door should be opened. There is two scrolls each containing three quests inside. Now for the first quest which is Dark Legend. We need to go to the luxury boat dealers of Floating Turtle, Hydra Island, and Castle on the Sea. Now we go to the luxury boat dealers of Floating Turtle. Click on the luxury boat dealer NPC and click next, until you see the pardon me option and click it. We arrive at Castle on the Sea. Here we arrive at the luxury boat dealer of Hydra Island. Once done you can see a message above. That means you have completed the quest. For the second quest, all you need to do is complete the raid of the pirates at the castle of the sea. Once the quest is done, you will see a message appear on top. Now for the final Tushita quest. We just need to kill Big Mom at Sea of Treats. Once you kill Big Mom, you will be teleported into heaven. You need to light up 3 torches to complete the trial. Beware, lighting up torches will spawn an enemy so be careful. Second torch. Third torch. Once you lit up the three torches and killed all the enemies, the portal will glow white and once you enter it, you will complete the Tushita scroll. For the pain and suffering quest, you just need to take damage from NPC and players over and over again, until you complete the quest. A message will appear once you completed the quest.
to the haze of misery quest. You need to kill all the NPC that has a purple dot in all the islands. I recommend bringing a friend to guide you because it will be very hard to see. Once you have killed all the NPC with purple dots on them, you will complete the quest. Now for the final quest for the Yammer. We need to get killed by the Soul Reaper boss which can be spawned using a Hollow Essence. Once you get killed by the Soul Reaper, you will be teleported to hell. You need to light up 3 torches in order to complete the quest. First torch. This was probably the craziest raid I ever had. Second torch. Third torch. Once you lit up the three torches and killed all the mobs, you will see a gate light up. Enter it to complete the quest. Click on the Yammer scroll and the Tushita scroll to burn them. Now go to the middle and interact with the pedestal. This will open the way to the final boss. The boss is easy as long as you keep distance because the boss deals a ton of damage. And there you have it, you got the cursed dual katana. Thank you for watching. This video took me so long to make so consider subscribing, because it helps a ton. Goodbye.